He stands for truth, justice and the American way. But what if the Man of Steel went down a different path? Ladies and gentlemen, this is Matt Rogers. Brightburn is the well-kept secret project of Guardians of the Galaxy writer and director James Gunn. We now know that David Yurovsky, who also worked alongside Gunn in Guardians of the Galaxy, will be taking the helm of directing. And after a teaser trailer released this week, we now have plot details. And DC superhero fans might find it rather familiar. The trailer shows almost exact shots and even font from the Man of Steel trailer, and my obsession with Superman and horror means I couldn't ask for a more perfect movie. Brightburn stars Elizabeth Banks as a mother who wishes for nothing more than a child, when one crashes down from on high. They raise the child as their own and realise his origins weren't the only thing abnormal about him. It's the typical story of him not fitting in because of his newfound powers, but this is where it gets interesting. Instead of saving kids on a bus, this Clark Kent starts terrorising locals. But my favourite part of all this is although he's donning the signature red cape, he's wearing this haunting makeshift mask, obviously intending to strike fear into the hearts of his victims. Because of all the symbols he's been drawing, it appears to be demonic intentions that all this is stemming from. Production and details on this film have so far been kept almost entirely under wraps. Back in July, Gunn teased for the announcement of the film at San Diego Comic-Con, but around that same time he was fired from penning Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 due to some previous offensive tweets, which led to the panel at Comic-Con being cancelled. Gunn and Elizabeth Banks previously worked together on the cult horror Slither, that time with him directing. Gunn had this to say about them once again working together. Quote, since Slither, she's since remained one of my best friends in the world, and I've been fighting tooth and nail to work with her again. She's the perfect partner to Yavo, the H Collective, and myself in creating this very special project. End quote. Brightburn comes to theatres May 24th, 2019, and I couldn't be more excited. At this point, it could go either way, though. Films like this can easier go wrong than right, but this premise is too perfect for me to keep my hopes in check. But let me know, what do you think? Is an evil Superman a fresh retelling of a well-known origin story, or despite its differences, is it just too similar to an all-too-familiar story? I'll be chatting with you guys in the comments, but until next time, this is Matt Rogers, and that is all.